We are continuing to follow breaking news for you out of Butler County. Good afternoon, I'm Maytal Levy. One person is in custody after four students were injured at Madison High School in Butler County, according to Middletown Police Chief Rodney Mutterspaugh. The police chief says two students were shot and two others were also injured. We just learned about the fourth injury. Earlier, the school district said the people hurt have non-life-threatening injuries. They've been taken to Miami Valley Hospital. And our partners at WLWT in Cincinnati talked to a parent who said an eighth grader brought a gun to school. Two News reporter Robert Lowry just arrived on scene. Robert, what are you seeing? That's right, Maytal. As you mentioned, four students we are hearing confirmed were injured in this shooting. Two were shot, two possibly by shrapnel in this case. They all have nine life threatening injuries. We actually just saw a helicopter take off from the high school. I'm going to give you an idea of where we are. We're on West Alexandria Road and Michael. We're about north of uh, Madison Junior Senior High School at this point. And as you can see, uh, a lot of cars backed up here, presumably uh, parents coming to pick up their kids. We have heard that. The high school is no longer on lockdown. They are letting students out at this time. Also, that Madison Elementary School will be dismissing early uh, by one hour today. So that's something that parents need to keep an eye on. But as of now, if you're trying to get to the high school, it's pretty much gridlocked at this point. Vehicles slowly moving down West Alexandria Road, trying to get to that location. Now, we are trying to get there, too. We will get more information as soon as we get it. But for now, reporting, Robert Lowry, 2 News, working for you. Thanks, Robert. The students injured have been taken to Miami Valley Hospital, where Two News reporter Kelly King is standing by. Kelly, what are you seeing? Hi, Maytel. I'm outside of Miami Valley, Valley Hospital right now, where I'm waiting on an update from hospital officials. Air flight here landed around 12:30, and we're told at least one of those victims was flown here. Now, school officials say, like you said, four students were injured, so we do not know how many of those victims are here at the Miami Valley Hospital. We do know, though, that one was flown here via care flight. We do not know their condition. However, officials say their injuries were all non-life threatening. Now, this again happened at Madison Local Schools. It was a junior senior high school on West Alexandria Road in Madison Township, where you saw Robert Lowry. We know one is in custody and the rest of the students are safe. Now, we have heard that parents have been notified if their student was injured. I am constantly trying to get an update from hospital officials, and I'm expecting an update in about 10 minutes, and I'll let you know once I get that information. I'll bring it to you live, but for now, reporting from Miami Valley Hospital, Kelly King, 2 News, working for you. Thanks, Kelly, and if you're just joining us once again, four students were injured at Madison High School in Butler County. One person is in custody. The Middletown Police Chief says two students were shot and two others were also injured. Our partners at WLWT in Cincinnati talked to a parent who said an eighth grader had a gun at the school. The school district is not on lockdown anymore. According to Madison Local Schools Facebook page, they have received clearance from the Butler County Sheriff's Office to begin dismissing students. Madison Elementary School will dismiss one hour early by bus. The district asks parents to be patient as safety is their top priority. We will continue following this story and bring you updates at WDTN.com and live tonight starting at 5 o'clock.